Wait a second. Welcome to my closet. Huge thank you to Target for sponsoring this video. So I just moved across the country and there is a lot to do. I threw a random dart at all of my home projects and it landed on my closet. So we're gonna renovate my closet, online shop together, plus I'll share with you my best closet tips for staying organized. And hopefully this video gives you a little bit of inspiration for your own closet and wardrobe. So here was our closet before. I know, totally embarrassing, a total disaster. I have no way of like shelving anything, no place to put my bags, my shoes. Dennis's side, he keeps it somewhat organized, but I'd say like the main issue here is with our closet, it doesn't really occupy the best space. And we're gonna have to make some magic happen here. We end up going for this style as one of our goals to make it a little bit more practical and efficient. My dad was in charge of designing and purchasing the parts and thank goodness, because you guys, I'm the worst with measurements and just math and all that jazz. We had received a few different quotes of custom closets it's being anywhere from seven thousand dollars to ten thousand uh yeah comment below if you would ever spend that much not over here so we were like no thanks we began by taking everything out and dennis my dad began by measuring and we began creating a blueprint for how it's going to look so once the shelves are made we began making drawers figuring out if we wanted some see-through ones how did we want the whole thing to look we started coming up with new ideas for the back wall as well because our closet is quite small and the struggle here was that they don't really sell corner closets anymore so we had to come up with a new solution Solution, which leads us to the final steps to fill up our closet. But first, let's do a little bit of shopping. Now that I have a new closet, homegirl needs new clothes. Welcome to this part of a series called Retail Therapy, where I shop until I feel better. It's just a chance for me to sit down, chat with you about life topics, things that we're struggling with. Grab yourself some tea and let's get to shopping and talking. Today we are heading into Target. A huge thank you to Target for sponsoring this video. This is such a dream, you guys. I have been shopping at Target since I was in middle school. They have the cutest things, so versatile, literally anything and everything that you would want. Home decor on point, clothing on point, accessories, apparel on point. I wanna start off by looking at some of their apparel and accessories. Kind of talk about my journey with clothing, confidence, and my body. So my mom legit used to dress me until I was like 13. It was always combination things, suede on suede, jean and denim on denim which today denim on denim i love it sometimes yeah my style it's definitely evolved well now i feel like i don't really shy away from the things that i once was afraid to wear for instance little tops like this i wear things that accentuate my features my bigger bootay my nice big thighs all self-love here i also don't shy away from color anymore and now i am all about it my whole office is splattered in color let's get some outfits shall we so we're going to fall so you know what that means pumpkin spice latte also it means i'm super excited to pick out some new pants and jackets for this fall season i love fall okay even though i live in florida i'm not gonna miss out on this oh my god i love this i'm going for this one. Ooh, i love this color let's get these in i think i'm also gonna go for this one because i'm obsessed this is so cute okay i'm gonna go for this one <gasps> i'm a huge fan of this color love this one gonna get that so cute i love the little pop of like color absolutely stunning oh look at that i'm already wearing this that's the editing magic i already purchased this one it's super cute comfy look at it little details this is how it fits Target, let me model your clothes. I also ended up purchasing these jeans, which are so freaking cute. Their mom jeans, they're the best. These are the jeans. They're nice and like loose, also high-waisted, and they have all these cute little accents throughout. Oh my God, so beautiful. I can just see myself already in the garden. Okay, yes, I'm getting this. You can't go wrong with jeans. Target has the best jeans. These look so cool. Yes, I want you. I actually ended up buying this shirt as well. Could not resist myself. It is the one that I'm wearing right now. Very nice, sleeveless, bodysuit perfect for fall perfect for summer you can layer it on top you could wear it without very very soft material and then we got a little hoodie never go wrong hoodies Thank you, Target. Target accessories and apparel has been my go-to since high school. They represent who I want to be and who I want to become. They make it super easy to explore styles, versatility, value, and hey, they're a one-stop shop. Plus, they're affordable and have always helped fuel my personal style and help me become me. If you enjoyed any of the outfits that I showed, be sure to check out Target.com or also their Target app to fuel your personal style, anything that you are into. Check out my description box to see all of the Target apparel and accessories shown in this video. Be sure to share a comment down below telling you a little bit about your personal style, inclusivity, and your identity. 
Welcome to my closet. This is our closet. I'm so happy with the way it turned out. It took a good four days of taking everything out, reconstructing, organizing. It was a lot of work. I would say for a very small closet, this actually turned out a lot better than we expected. They did not sell corner shelves, so we were gonna lose a ton of space over here. So we ended up putting a mirror here. It just makes it look a lot bigger. It's quite nicer, I think. I think it's also more functional. Makes everything kind of more cohesive. I'm super happy with the way it turned out. It took us forever to find Finally do this project. I really wanted a section for all of my shirts. I wanted to hang a lot of things. Also with my jeans over here. I kind of started by coordinating this a little bit. There's not really much of a scheme here, but it works for me. We ended up creating a section for the dresses, which is perfect. What now, are those? These are my little slippers that I love so much. They get full show. The Lakuma slippers. They're super comfy. Yeah, why was I not wearing these? So we also ended up getting this thing that comes out, but honestly, you guys, it's not as functional. It more so just looks nice. We just left one in there. This is what I personally love. We ended up putting a little section for my jewelry and it is so helpful. I didn't even know I owned all of these glasses. This makes it more visually ready. These are little compartments that you can get in Ikea and you can just kind of switch them around. I don't have jewelry. <laughs> But you also got this, but you can see your hats and it's very helpful, right? I have stuff underneath that one. Bam! Bling it up. This is probably my favorite part of it all. I really wanted lots of space to hang things. That's very pretty. Oh yes, this is a purse I got in Colombia. Then we have extra storage up top. We're not really using right at the moment. So we have lots of storage above. On this side, Dennis also has a ton. These I honestly just coordinated by color. Whites, grays. I just have way too many different things. And then our mirror, which I think was a really good choice. I need to add something above here this isn't fully finished so i love our closet comment below what you guys think dennis also just wanted to hang ton of things he has so many shirts shirts upon shirts sweaters upon bogs then over here we have the hats the jewelry bogs more bogs workout workout yes. oh one little tip you guys anything that you have a lot of fold it as marie kondo would say this roly foley way vertical way yeah yeah it's vertical. the best way because you see it instead of stacking it so like all of these sweaty pants well not sweaty pants <laughs> sweatpants you know you get to just easily take Take them out. Both of our sides are pretty similar. He has more sweaters, more stuff. I think I have more of like an artistic kind of look. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, you have that bag. Yeah, that's probably not gonna be functional. It's just for the video. It's pretty much all for our closet tour. Comment below what you guys thought. How much did this cost us? It's about $1,300. Which, which is think, amazing compared to all the quotes that we got. But that is not including labor. There was, was like. the labor with your dad. And your dad. And my, and dad. my mom. And We're your mom. Labor. And us. And we got paid zero. It doesn't matter. So there you have it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Do you ever struggle with not knowing where to put things? Your items just keep getting lost, mixed together, and everything feels kind of cluttered all the time. Well, there is a simple solution for this problem. Make them a home. Your items don't know where to go until you designate a place for them. And to remind yourself of where each item goes, simply label the bins, the boxes, or drawers with markers, whatever you'd like. Here's some ideas as well. It's such a foolproof method and especially helpful when you're living with other people, so ensure everyone is on the same page. If you spend way too long looking for a specific item, the solution is to color code your closet. Now, this might be a little time consuming in the beginning, but this will pay off and save you so much time in the future, not to mention it looks really satisfying in the end. It's an easier way to find a shirt that you're looking for if you know what color it is and also just the vibe you want to go for. And then you are only looking between a small section of your closet for the item instead of the whole thing. My girl Marie Kondo has actually taught me some really valuable ways to fold and store my clothes so that I can stay organized and decluttered at all times. So try these folding methods in order to fold all your clothes together and access them easily. Pretty much what you do is when you're ready to put your clothes away in drawers, make sure you're placing them side by side instead of stacking. That way you can see everything you have and you'll never mess up the rest of your clothes when trying to retrieve an item. If your clothes are losing that fresh linen smell, then all you have to do is really get these little DIY air fresheners and there you go. If you're like me and you spent way too much time untangling your favorite pieces, then here is a little trick. Similar to the tip that I gave earlier about creating places for your clothes and shoes, also make sure you're designating a place for your jewelry. Now the best way to store your necklaces, for instance, is to hang them or to just lay them flat kind of like this. For your rings, your earrings, and your bracelets, you can also keep these organized with a little jewelry bowl or a jewelry storage that is designed to hold these items like this one right here I'm absolutely obsessed with this and it also just helps me accessorize whatever outfit that I'm wearing for the day it's so worth it if you love jewelry avoid a wardrobe emergency if you ever need to fix a button sew a hole remove a small stain keep a little emergency bin full of stain removers to go mini sewing kits buttons etc this will save you so much time in the long run it could also include blister tape double-sided tape safety pins pretty much anything for any kind of future malfunction
Be sure to check out these freebie worksheets. I have a ton of them down below, including cute to-do lists, daily checklists, sleeping logs, coloring pages, all these little freebies are just for you. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And I wanna give a huge shout out to this beautiful person. If you'd like a shout out in my next video, all I have to do is share any of my IG pics on stories. It can be a quote, an artwork, or just one of myself, whatever you'd like. I will personally DM you as well. And that's it, it's that simple. If you'd like to connect with me after hours, you are welcome to connect with me at this number right here. We can talk about anything that you'd like. Oh, if you miss me until then, you can always check out my vlog channel. I'm posting often on there, lots of renovation videos, lots of home tour, decor, all that jazzy stuff. I love you guys. I'm gonna send you lots of love, good vibrations, hugs, kisses. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. A huge thank you to Target for sponsoring this video. I literally had to wait like an hour until the person that was cutting the grass outside to be quiet so that I can finally film this video for you guys. I love you so much. Pretty well, my friends. Okay. I probably should not have done that. Okay. 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 Welcome to my closet. Drop it down. <laughs> Oh, wait, this isn't working. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Welcome to my closet. To our closet. Oops. And also be sure to share a comment. And also please be sure. And also please be sure to share. I can't talk today.